Did almost nothing defensively as a team. The second half, he held him about 130 yards. Not a lot. Yeah, I think the second half, we definitely grew as a team. Um, we came out there and, and, and we, we fought back. We fought back hard. And obviously, you can see that's um, evident in the score. You know, brought it back to 55 58. Uh, I feel like if we had more time, a little bit more time, you know, the outcome would have been a little bit different. Did you change anything at halftime? Because they were just chewing you up in the first half. Just our mentality, you know, we just said, hey, let's go out there and just hit them back in the mouth. You know, they came out swinging at first, um, and then we just went in and had some, came back out, and we were ready to go, you know. How frustrating was that first half for you guys? It was definitely frustrating. I mean, it's just pound, pound, uh, pound the ball, ball football, you know, and just trying to pound it down your throat, you know, and um, I think in that first half, it was just came out a little <coughs> slow, you know, but uh, definitely picked it up in the second half and, and, and definitely fought back hard and brought the score back into a reasonable means. Was it a matter, matter of you guys get more physical in the second half? Or? Definitely. I think we definitely got more physical in the second half. You had to against that team. Had to, man. Had to. <coughs> With how well they run block, was winning first down a big key for you guys? Oh, yeah, definitely. But I mean, against any team winning first down, it's, it's huge. You know? For a defensive player to play in a game that's both teams going into 50s, that's got to be a little disheartening, right? I mean, yeah, but I mean, that's on both sides of the ball. You know, that, that means that uh, both sides, both defenses have something to work on. That's what that means. You guys haven't lost any confidence defensively yet? No, definitely not. You know, uh, with previous Duke teams, this this battling back and bringing the score with, with where it happened to be this time probably wouldn't happen. But this is the new Duke, you know, so we're getting better. We're getting better every game, and I think we def definitely grew as a, as, a, as a team in the second half. How do you convince people that see that 50 on the board that you guys are getting better? How, how do you convince them that? You go ahead and say, come line up against us, and we'll show you. No, piss last ride. Uh, you guys had a third and long, but they completed the pass. Just how much did it hurt uh, to see that after you guys have fought so hard to get back? I mean, it, it was definitely – we took a blow, you know. We took a blow. But um, we definitely fought back hard. I mean, we, we, we came back, you know, from a, from a pretty pretty good deficit, you know. And um, we, we worked and we showed people that, that this, is, this is a new Duke team, you know, where, where we're coming, you know. And what did Coach tell you guys in the locker room after? I mean, he, he said, don't hang your heads, you know. We still got a lot of football left to play, and he's right, you know. So, you know, we're going to take this, go watch the tape. We're going to get back out there on practice Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, learn from it, and we we got to move on. You know, he always talks about next play and next game. What do you think are some of the keys to improving the pass rush? Getting off blocks, you know. I mean, we, I think we, we, st we stayed on blocks a little too long, you mm -hmm. know, just worried about that run, you know, trying to stop the run, stop the run, stop the run, then you got to convert. And is that something that you saw improving throughout the game today? Yeah, definitely, especially in the second half. As a defensive guy, as a game like that's going on, 